New yeah. video alert! Yeah, yeah. This yeah. is a new yeah. video yeah. alert! Yeah, yeah. There yeah. is a new yeah. Yeah. Xbox Phone Pokemon video! Yeah, yeah. It's out! Yeah. Yeah. It's out now! Yeah. New yeah. video! Yeah. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a very special episode today. An iconic piece of modern Pokemon history. Feast your eyes on the Team Rocket special case. I cannot wait to actually open this thing up. Um, I actually spilt coffee on mine, which is, you guys are probably going to be mad at me knowing how uh, expensive this box now is. Yeah, I used to just keep mine sitting on the floor. Why was this stored on the ground? Um, I am a demon. So this product launched during the XY break era for the 20th anniversary, and it could only be purchased from the Pokemon Center online. But the thing that makes this kind of a, a special case, <laughs> no pun intended, is that it was made to order. A lot of the stuff, that, like modern stuff that gets to ludicrous prices was kind of bottlenecked because it was only such a limited amount printed and you had to enter, they do this thing in Japan where you have to enter like a lottery and if you get drawn out of the lottery then you have the privilege of buying the item that you wanted to buy. Not the case with this. This run ran for a, a month, a full month. Anybody could get in their order and this would be made to order for you. You would get your order fulfilled. We are going to open this thing up. I just wanted to say, I'm not gonna put any specific prices on the stuff that we're about to see inside this box. Uh, it's very all over the place. It's kind of hard to narrow down items when you're going this big, especially because it's, it's part of this sealed thing. We've got some promo cards in here and we've seen some insane sales for this product. Sometimes I think you can get it for a lot cheaper if you're lucky. But even on the Japanese sites, we've seen some absolutely crazy sales. But yeah, maybe you can get it a lot cheaper now. Sometimes, some places, it's it's just a very finite thing. Oh my god. I've never actually seen one in person before. It's an actual Team Rocket briefcase. We've got the actual clasps up the top. Give you a little spin. Uh, damn, yeah, it's it's a it's a, a quality like a metal case or like plastic and metal But yeah, I think this was right before Pokemon went absolutely nuclear and everyone was trying to buy everything to make money I mean that vibe was kind of already starting to happen for modern stuff, but this retailed for 12,000 yen I think around that so I think that's why there wasn't that many people uh, buying these. Obviously, a lot more would have been purchased if everybody had the foresight that the price would go up so much. Okay, so I opened this sucker up. Let me get you. Oh, look at that blurred inventory. All right, I'm going to have to give you a card. I'm blue balling you too long. Here it is. Is that worth? Is that worth it? You decide. I don't know how I'm actually going to do this. All right, let's see this card. No, I have not washed my hands today. And yes, I did just take a shit. Uh, I'm kidding. But here he is, Gio Giovanni himself. He looks um, very sinister. I'll give you a pan up. He's got his Persian there, which looks almost just like uh, an actual real big cat. And yeah, it's a promo card, 2017. The other one in here, I think, in my opinion, is nicer. There is two. We're going to take a look at that in just a second. But here you go, bask in his glory. Let's get him into a sleeve. It should probably be illegal for someone like me to handle a card like this. But here we are. Now, if you can grade this card yeah, yeah. high enough, people will pay a pretty penny for that as well. One day I should probably uh, do some grading. I've literally never graded a card in my life. I've never sold a card either. All right, object number two. Looks a little bit uh, creased, but we've got the rocket sleeves, rocket deck sleeves. Plain and simple, uh, just like the case. The classic rocket black, the classic rocket red. Next up, the coin, rocket gold coin. Again, uh, simplicity with this stuff, but we do have a, a sort of uh, more detailed back there, a bunch of stars, a Pokeball, Team Rocket. And then we have up next the deck case, and it changes up a little bit. 
with making the R holographic. Okay, interesting. But what you're all been waiting for, here it is. Or should I say, here comes Team Rocket. Yes, it's a very special alt art for that card. Here it is, let's slide it out. It's maybe looking a little bit warped, but here it is! Look at that. Is that just the best thing you've ever seen? Uh, now this one, you may not be surprised, I, I believe has the higher value um, between the two if they're sold separately. But it's just this very, very anime type rendition of Here Comes Team Rocket. It's a full art. It's gorgeous. They make the characters look very uh, cutesy cutesy. From the XY promos, this is promo number 278. Oh, I can't believe I'm seeing this in real life. Something that's been sitting on my floor in a box with the coffee stain on it for all these years. Uh, yeah, I have actually had this box since basically when it came out. Let's get this thing in a sleeve. Let's get this sucker yeah, yeah. in a case. And there it is, guys. This entire video for these two cards are really strung you along here. Don't worry, I, I think I'm going to open up some other stuff. But thank you so much for being here for this opening. I've really wanted to open these for so long. I think it just kind of freaks me out, uh, picturing having to open and handle cards like this. I just feel like I'm not qualified. <laughs> Anyway, you came, you saw, let's close this chapter out. I will say though, I have seen auctions with the case and the two cards, I think PSA 10 for as much as uh, this sometimes sells on its own sealed. All right, should we open up some junk? What have we got here? Fill out this video with a couple of packs. Let's get five of these from the Japanese and let's do some Scarlet and Violet um, English base set, I reckon. Also, sorry that uh, for the past like month, there's only been two videos. I have been dealing with some shit with YouTube. Uh, hopefully that new uh, disclaimer at the start can help me leverage my way back. But they keep setting... Oh shit, Japanese. Basically they keep setting my videos to four kids. Which destroys everything. It makes, it makes it so there's no comments on the video. Um, it can't be... Sh uh, it doesn't get shared around at all. It just stays in the kids app. And on top of that, it's just, why would they want that? Like, if they fight me so hard to keep those things, I think it's because a lot of it is run by AI when I put in uh, a request. Like, I appeal their decision, and they're supposed to take a look at it. But then I get a message back like, yeah, we looked at it. We, we fucking, we had someone properly look at it, and we still think it's made for kids. Fuck you, it's now stuck there permanently. Uh, but they, that decision is made in, like, six seconds. They, they could never have watched the video. It's just all bullshit. Anyway... It's, it makes no sense because I am saying fuck and you are wanting to put that into children's recommended and have that cycling through the kids' brains. So do yourself a favor, YouTube, for me and you. And let me rate my videos fairly. They are definitely not specifically made for kids. Anyway, yeah, behind the scenes of uh, been going through a bit of grief with that. But hopefully we are back. We've got the fireball. We have the duck. We have been getting nothing in these, actually, now that I think about it. That's our first thing. A sabli. A sabli hollow. Okay. One more of these Japanese packs. Oh, uh, yeah, I think I've missed uh, the Jap... There was a new Japanese uh, two-piece set with a very expensive modern... Talking about expensive modern stuff. Yeah, one of the most expensive boxes that have come out in uh, modern times. So I do have to get on that. And I have a hell of a ton of One Piece boxes I want to open. I want to do a massive One Piece opening sometime soon as well. All right, let's crack this open. Let's give you guys the code. We're moving on to English. Um, what is it again? Is it just nothing now? Is it just throw that off? I think, yes, correct. Shop it. Tender, tender Mouse, we've got Smoliv, Primeape, Bombardia, Beach Court, Curlia, Reverse. Oh yeah, the guaranteed reverses. Jesus Christ, Bruxish. And we're gonna start it with a Spidops EX. I probably have the world's biggest collection of Spidops EX. I do not want more Spidops EX. Come on, bruh, miss me with that shit. All right, up next. Let's see. There is the code. Getting rid of the water. Because Fat fucking pig. Katie, Maradon. Reverse. Primeape. Reverse, and Don Dozo, the upgraded Whale Lord. Three more packs, 
and we'll call it a day. Let's see what get from this. There is code. Get rid of this. Bird. Zangoose. Frog. Mouse. Bird. Penny. Reverse. Houndoom. Reverse. Bada bing bada boom. Car. Car. Hey guys, new Pokemon here. Okay, two more to go. Come on now! Alright, here is the code. Get rid of card. Alright, alright, come on. Ten packs between Japanese and English. You're gonna tell me. You're not gonna do... You're not gonna throw me a bone here. Surely something. What is going on? What is this shit? Alright, Scarlet and Violet. Base set English final pack. There is the code. Getting rid of whatever the fuck that was. Yeah, I gotta I gotta keep swearing more now. I'm probably gonna up my swearing. Uh, it's so it's so fucked up. <laughs> you like that? Because I have to walk this line of don't swear too much or it'll be age restricted. But if you don't swear at, enough, it'll be set to made for kids. And there's just kind of nothing I can do except play this sick twisted game. Poor Mott. <gasps> what? This gold energy? <laughs> this gold? This triple star rank? This secret? There's secret energies. I didn't think I knew there was gold energies in here. Fellas, the final pack coming through. God damn. All right, well, in the end, the goblin did get his gold. Love to see it. Yeah, yeah. There it is. Anyway, guys, thanks for coming through. Uh, it's a shame I had to crack open the box of this, but not really because I did already have a second one. <laughs> Slight flex. I'm gonna keep, keep this one sealed, probably. Not gonna lie, I think I had them stacked and this one might have coffee on it also. Sorry that I do not have new Pokemon postcards. Oh, wait! Max Mofos postcard collection! It's the segment where Pokemon postcard, I do have some new Pokemon postcard. Let's take a look. All right, ooh, ooh, Ben Presto, Mew. Mewtwo, it's very basic. Uh, I think it's using like existing art there, these assets. But I think it looks pretty clean. I kind of like it. I dig it. And I like this little uh, Pikachu at the top left corner there. Trying to suck his own cock. And the deck sleeve of the day is Lechonk, the obese pig. We've got a brown border. And we've got a fat pig in the woods. Uh, I think he's about to get up and eat those flowers. Thanks for watching, guys. Um, if you would like to see another video, in the middle is another video, please click on this video, even if you have seen video. That would help me out. And I will see you guys when I see you. Goodbye. <laughs>